Hey guys, it's Brianna and today's video is going to be how I got my Winterite Hamster Tinkerbell. About a year ago, during May of 2014, I purchased Tinkerbell, my now one-year-old sapphire winter white hamster. At that time, my hamster spies had passed away and I only had Hazel and my hamster family. I'd been having some winter white withdrawal symptoms and missed having a big Syrian to cuddle with. So I was able to convince my mom to let me get two hamsters. First I picked up Bambi and then I headed over to PetSmart. I had just finished playing in the pit for my school's musical Peter Pan and thought how perfect it would be to get a sapphire winter white and name her Tinkerbell. Although I always name my pets after I get them because I like to fit the personality with the name, but little did I know who was waiting for me at PetSmart. Once I walked into the store, I went straight to the hamster section. There were two cages with winter whites. First, I looked in the cage to the left which had two agouti winter whites. Then I looked at the cage to the right and saw two more agoutis. But upon closer inspection, I saw a little sapphire winter white sleeping inside the igloo house. I was so excited because I'd never seen a sapphire winter white before in person. Honestly, the moment I laid my eyes on her, I knew she was mine. After getting an employee's help, I was able to stick my hand into the cage. The two agouti winter whites were upset to see a huge hand in their cage, trying to nip and wanting nothing to do with me. But I moved my hand over to sleeping Tink and she gave no thought to me picking her up. She was very easygoing, as if to be like, okay, cool, now can I just go back to sleep? She reminded me a lot of Shubby, my past Winter White, because the process of picking her out was almost the exact same situation. Shubby was the smallest of the three Winter Whites in a cage. The other two Winter Whites squealed and would have surely bit me if I tried to pick them up. But Shubby was just sleeping under the bedding and gave no second thought to being picked up other than wanting to go back to sleep. So, after purchasing my new Sapphire Winter White, I felt like Tinkerbell would be the perfect name. Since then, I've nicknamed her my little fairy hamster, feeling like her sapphire coloring gives her a fairy-like appearance. She's also grown into her name, being very sassy but has the sweet typical winter white personality of loving humans. Now, Tink is over a year old and is one of my favorite hamsters, but don't tell the others. She comes when I tap at the front of her cage and will climb up the bars to be taken out. She loves sunflower seeds and can explore outside for hours. She's featured the most on my Instagram due to her photogenic personality and is my perfect little buddy. So that concludes my video on how I purchased Tinkerbell. Thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!